Indiana medical professionals are concerned since the start of a measles outbreak. There's been an unprecedented number of cases, and many of those cases have been in Washington state. But more recently, there have been outbreaks in nearby states. Working for you, our Alyssa Donovan explains local doctors are worried it will pop up here. There have been 228 confirmed cases in 12 states since the start of the year, including cases in neighboring states, Illinois and Kentucky. Um, we're certainly worried about it here in Indiana. Dr. Jim Wood at Riley Hospital says there have been a few scares, but no confirmed cases of measles in the state. The main symptoms of measles include cough, congestion, red eyes and fever, and a rash that spreads from your face along your body. The majority of people who have been infected were not vaccinated. According to the CDC, the MMR vaccine is the most effective way to prevent measles. However, many people choose not to vaccinate because they're concerned about side effects. Most of the things that we talk to families about are kind of long-term effects of the vaccine. And we do know from a lot of studies that have been done um, that it's a very safe vaccine. Prior to the MMR vaccine, 500,000 cases of measles were reported every year in the U.S. We haven't seen it in the U.S. very often um, in a long time, but it's certainly something we worry about as something that can cause kids to have to come into the hospital and even cause uh, death. Doctors are also worried that these outbreaks are just the start. The biggest concern we have is that although we've kind of eradicated it from um, the U.S. in terms of it coming every season or every year, um, we do worry that it could come back. I'm Alyssa Donovan, RTV6.